morning. It is pretty early, it's about six o'clock. I am just about to head off to my first class of the day. Lots of you have been asking me for another what I eat in a day video, so I thought I would take you with me in my pocket and keep you updated with what I eat today. It's a bit of a weird day where I'm off to teach and then I'm going to Morning Gloryville and then I am working for the rest of the day. So I'll check back in with you soon. So it is 7.45 ish. I have just finished my first class at Frame. I always make sure that I take my swell bottle and fill it up with water so that I have something to drink while I'm teaching. I get really, really thirsty. And that means that by the time that I have finished class, I've already um, drunk a couple of cups of water, which is great. This morning's a little bit different. I am dressed in sparkles and I am going to Morning Glory Belt. So I'm gonna hop in my bike, hop on my bike and cycle over there and hopefully be able to grab some breakfast on the way. Outside for a minute, I picked up a smoothie from the smoothie bar um, for some breakfast, and I'm gonna head back in to do a bit more dancing. So I'm back home after morning Gloryville. It was such a fun way to start the day. I'm kind of glittery, I have foam in my hair, but yeah, it was really good to start the day with a bit of dancing. I ended up sharing my smoothie with my friends, so I just popped home for some, pro some proper breakfast. I've got quite a plain bowl of porridge and peanut butter, trying to be really quick so that I can get on with some work. It's about 11.30, I'm at The Hive, which is where I often come and do some work. I am drinking an almond milk chai, which is absolutely delicious. I'm trying to get through all of my emails. Hey guys, so it's lunchtime. I am still at The Hive, still doing my emails. So I have ordered one of my favorite things on the menu here. It's a squash deer, um, but I've taken out the ghost cheese or ordered it without ghost cheese. So it is scrambled tofu and um, roasted butternut squash with salad. It's absolutely delicious. It's one of my favorite things on the menu here. I really recommend it if you ever come. So seeing as it's Christmas, I've ordered a mince pie. So it's got a slice of carrot cake. It's shown a big thing of water, trying to make sure that we drink enough. I can't wait to tuck into this little thing. Hey guys, I just got in from covering a class this evening. I normally eat at about 5.30, 6 o'clock in the evening and it's now 8 o'clock so I'm just trying to throw something together really quickly. I have made a kale salad. Yeah, there's a kale salad. It's just kale with tahini, a bit of brown rice miso, some apple cider vinegar and a little bit of oil. And then I am doing some edamame. So I'm just heating through now, they were frozen. They're a really great source of protein. So I'm adding them into my dinner, especially after my cycle, hence looking so disheveled. And then I have got some hummus, um, which I actually bought. I normally make it myself, but I wanted to be super quick this evening. So I'm not eating too late. Um, so I bought some hummus. And then I've got a little bit of very boring steamed broccoli from last night. So I'm just gonna whack in the pan with the edamame just for a little bit of extra green. Really simple, easy dinner. I've got some work to do tonight, so yeah, I wanna crack on. So the last thing to show you guys this evening is this little bowl of delicious sweetness. I'll definitely be on, on such a sweet vibe today with mince pies and I forgot to tell you that I had a couple of medial dates before I went into my last class. But this is some frozen berries. I picked up a little pot of coconut yogurt, uh, which I haven't had in ages. So I had to have some this evening with a little bit of peanut butter and another medial date. So I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm gonna finish up my emails and try and get into bed, have an early night, read my book. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>